Hello, Bob Allison, WB1GCM here at the ARR Laboratory. Let's take a look at that Palstar BT1500A balanced antenna tuner. Now this is a double L tuner. Two controls, the capacitor and the roller inductor. If you're trying to load loads less than 50 ohms, like a short antenna, you flip that in like that. Or if you need some more capacitance, you can push that button in for less capacitance or more capacitance with that button out. Adjust the L and the C for minimum SWR on the cross needles. And look, there's actually a zero adjustment for the meter. That's handy, especially on those staticky days and dry weather. Um, your power range, 3,000 watts or 300 watts on the meter here, uh, peak and average, that's peak hold. Uh, turn that on there. Not much to see back here, folks. Move along, move along. Uh, no, just kidding. Uh, here's the power input here for the meter lamps and the relays. And your station ground. Again, make sure you ground this antenna tuner. Uh, your input from your transceiver and simply and only the balanced uh, output for your ladder line, your window line, or even your twin lead. This capacitor is massive. And the roll inductor action is smooth, although it's a little stiff. I'm sure that would break in. They have the sensor back here for the meter. The, uh, there's a ballon on the input side of this tuner. That's underneath these relays. And here are the two relays that are powered by the external DC power. You uh, want to tune anything that's lower than 50 ohms, you press the button in. And for higher than 50 ohms, you let that go, and the relay pops up. And if you need more capacitance thrown into the circuit for those lower bands, there you go. There's your other relay. They're pretty quiet and they don't draw very much current. The BT1500A ran cool during our high power tests and I determined the low impedance range to be down to 25 ohms. I'm Bob Allison, WB1GCM at the ARR Laboratory.